Maybe we are not. Hey guys, are we back? You guys hear me? Anyone here? Droid cam. Let's stop droid cam, I guess. And um, anyone here? Is this room back? I think it works better now. I didn't drop any bandwidth. I don't know what's wrong with Silknet, my internet provider. Well, they don't look like they're doing a great job. Okay. Guys, are we back? Let me droid cam this guy. 100. Uh, let's go. God damn it. Why isn't it working? Anyone here in the chat? Uh, anyone here? Now the performance is way better than it was. Hey guys, you here? Uh, the stream... What's happening? Something weird happened right now. Wait. Gotta check some stuff, properties. Capture specific. Why isn't this here? Telltale games. I actually. Okay, let's close this. This right cam. Um, okay. Droid cam, and I think we should be. We are here. We're back. I think we're back. Okay, hello. We are back. I hope we're back. I don't know what's with the internet today. Are we back? You guys see me? We back, so let's continue, I guess. Resume game. You guys ready? Let's do this. Tears. I can take your shot out of the sky. I can handle, I can handle it. it. Shit! Yo, they got wrecked. The hell they go! Whatever got in, don't let it get out. Are we still lagging, guys? We are, right? No? We good? Nice. Oh shit. What's that? Okay, be careful there. Who's this guy? Yo, they got pranked. Pranked by Batman. Ooh. Oh shit, 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 shit. What? RT? Nice. That's so cool. Yo. Back to back, circle up. You can circle up to Batman. Guys, scared. Uh, 
Ooh. Disarming the guys. This is so cool. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on, come Alfred on, also on. looks really come cool. On. Let's get this guy. Hey. Reflex is on point. Hey, okay. Down and day. What now? 1v1? You can't take on Batman. Just run, man. Legit, just run. Oh no, I messed up, I think. Oh. Damn, Batman just demolished this guy. Use A and RT. Ooh. You gotta be kidding me. That's so cool. Yo! Behind you, big boy. What the? Selena. Hey, got him. You can't outrun me, Catwoman. Shit, they he, she locked the doors. Stay where you are. You're under arrest. I'm Batman. What are you guys talking about? Intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the police. It's a scare tactic now. Just a performance. Alfred looks so cool in the game. All of the characters we've seen until now are all of them are Not a cool. Scratch. So far. So far. Damn. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all of this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in art. The city needs. Gotham needs a hero. Okay. Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me what? A villain? Sounds fun. Gotta admit it though. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Then let's put you in a cage. Ooh. Bring it, Bat. You have violated the law. Pay the fine or pay with your blood. Ooh. Battle with Catwoman? This might be hard. Okay. Now we're the one attacking. Oh shit. This is so cool. The cutscenes are great. You really think that's gonna work on Batman? Chill out. Ooh. We broke her glasses. And she scratched us, damn. Gotham City News. Oh shit. My uh, nose got itchy a little bit, but it's no time for that. Ooh. WWE on her ass. It's over. I wouldn't be so sure. Oh shit. She's good. She's really good. Get her over here. Oh my god, her ass. Yo, he's here. Don't shoot me. Ooh, 
you're gonna watch us fight now. Why? Down, left. We are actually destroying her right now. A and R T B A. We got the thing that she stole, I think. Damn, Bruce. Why go to all that trouble for this? Yeah, what's that? Shit. A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. Didn't he say don't God shoot? Damn it! I said don't shoot! No! Wait! Are we gonna catch her after that shot we took? Ooh! Neutralize! Oh sh I, I think I killed her. Let's save that ass. I think we're gonna catch her, right? No problem. Oh wait. Say. Hey again. Catch her, catch her, Bruce. Can you actually drop her down there? Catch her. She's okay. She's okay. Guess I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. You can't escape. Don't struggle. You'll fall. Don't struggle or you'll fall. Oh, but that's what you crave. The struggle. I know men like you. Come up. Bye, Bat. <laughs> this bitch! <laughs> she went Spider-Man on that ass. Ugh. Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. No, no. We having Down a party to today? Well, hello, hello. Achievement locked. Welcome to Gotham City. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Now, for too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. Together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. How we dent also looks really cool. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late as always. Hello, guys. What's up? Say hi, Bruce. Hi, enjoy my wines. Welcome to... Uh, welcome to welcome Wayne, to Manor. Wayne Manor. Manor, everyone. My apologies for the late arrival. Oh, not to worry, Mr. Wayne. We've all made ourselves very comfortable. This game looks cool. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change Gotham. Of course. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice working with the donors, the night shift? The everyone will leave you alone. But just working the night shift. Yeah, well then you're pulling a double. No one came here tonight to see me. They want to see the Bruce Wayne. Am I right? Who <laughs> pops are just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little FaceTime with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a 
place for families again. I'm doing this. I'll do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. A new face for Gotham. Like our hope is in Harvey. Put a dent in crime. Which, for the record, I have not been since before law school. All right, all right, all right. How about uh, a new face for Gotham? Be hmm? you. It's not half bad. Yeah, it actually that? sounds cool. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Isn't he gonna ask about the scars we have? Yeah, true. He's gonna get a new face, I guess. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like we can all make a difference, this right? To greatness. Well, thank you. But we're all here tonight because we want to make a difference. And that's what it's going to take. Every single one of us. Not just me, not just Mr. Dent. Everyone. Right, right. Of course. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. This city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante <laughs> justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman or whatever it's hope can like it well, I have to say I side with your wife on this mr. Zellerbach even a spark of hope can light the darkness oh an idealist with a bank account he'll be broke before election day <laughs> I know Bruce would gladly spend every penny he has to fix this city I don't doubt that for a moment and don't worry though I am not doing this alone and with Bruce's help we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery now that's in some alleyway. Something you terrible. shouldn't say right now, Truly I think. Yeah, and tragedy like that at such a young age. Must have been crippled. Stop poking my heart. Deranged man had gotten the right treatment. Maybe. Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes. We're here for and Harvey, sure not me. Either. Well, Harvey is the one who's been behind the project since day one. The vote for him is a vote for the memory of my parents. You'll have it. Thank you. And thank you both. They're like poking my heart. It was so sad. Saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. What's that sound? Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. Well, Keep it off the record, then. Tonight is strictly off the record. We can talk, but nothing gets written down. I'm okay with that. I was just hoping to see what makes Bruce Wayne tick. 
This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now. It's so formal. Call me Bruce. Well, <laughs> Bruce, you've been going around pleasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Better know that you're here? Hell no. Who's this girl? Everyone loves the host. You're king for a day. Just a day? Well, <laughs> I would have guessed Bruce Wayne has that feeling year-round. Yeah, well, I take nights and weekends off. Mr. Wayne, you've... you've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Oops. Yeah. It looks like... Cut myself shaving. Oh, this? No, that's nothing. It's just, uh... Cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. <laughs> Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. He looks so sure cool. He's so good. To greet this one personally, sir. Carmine Falcone? Darth. Is no spoilers, please. Votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. I'm sure you know everything that's going on here, but please don't say anything and about the story. What kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. Maybe you can Falcon, this doesn't Jesus, look good, so man. Inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser doesn't exactly look good for your squeaky clean image. Let me worry about that. Word of warning, Bruce. Play nice. You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. That's disrespectful AF. So disrespectful. Though the decor offends my eyes. Let's talk oh, privately. Man, all flash, no class. Let's talk privately, shall we? <laughs> he walks in my house and is like, damn, I'll, I'll buy this. Shut the fuck up. I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce ourselves. But we'll get to that. Carmine Falcone, thank you for welcoming me into your home. I didn't welcome you. Oh, they're watching us. Everyone is watching us. You're a respectable man, I hear. Shut the fuck up disrespecting me in my own house? Get on, get on. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me. Falcone my ass. As you should know, Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. At... Hey, what's... What Private the? Audience. Private audience? Come on, guys. Bruce. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of... Harvey comes with me. He's minutes. a bro, man. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. You don't respect shit. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... What did I say? Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. What? What's happening? But in my experience, there's the law and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just say any will. Unlike most people I've met, Harvey actually has integrity. He's trying to make Gotham a better place. So am I. So are you. Hey, we all carry this city on our broken backs. Yeah, that's true. Might lighten the load if we do so together. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. 
chocolates for me. This mm, throws. Mm, okay, listen up. I ain't doing. To I can get toss him the chalk. Or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever happens to being a gracious host. Okay, imagine. This is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home. Hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light. If need be. Between your business and mine, Harvey. I bet we employ half the city. Look, I'm only talking to you because Harvey asked. Trusting a friend to know what's best for Gotham. Now that's a predicament. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand the situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. What does that mean? And which to break. You should go. I'll have someone see you out. Okay. Okay. So that's how it's gonna be. People don't say no to me. Not for long. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. Already? I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. Shut up, Falcon. You come into my house, disrespect me, disrespect my father. Chill out. This is so cool. Good job, Telltale. It already looks cool AF. Yeah. So how do you like the game so far, guys? Is it cool? I think it's cool. What? Oh, we're going to the bad cave, I guess. With the elevator. He wanted us to be his pawn, but hell no. It's me. This soundtrack sent chills down my spine. Ooh, what's this? Soundtracks already. Our parents' memory, huh? She was really after him. <laughs> we got some evidence. Well, Telltale has one of the coolest stories in all of its games, so I think it should have a great story. Analyze the data and drive. Where's the drive? Here. Bruce and his gaming chair. 
That's why that was so important. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here, <laughs> in a dark, damp cave, in front of a computer. I'm working. I'll as soon as I finish. People with regular jobs can do their work anywhere, but for me, this is my office. I agree. It is Fortnite all night, night in the cave. Even worse, the best outcome is that no one ever finds out you've done it. Yeah, well, good deeds usually go unnoticed. Uh, though not unappreciated. Did you find out what that um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. What are we looking at? Let me try a different angle. Oh, are we gonna do a puzzle? Uh, rotate the hologram. So, um, huh. this is a map of the east side shoreline, but it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Hmm. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. Decrypting data has zero percent. It looks like it's a hard thing to decrypt. I right? you what I could. Thanks, so. Al. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat. I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder Thanks to remove. Thanks for your help, us, Alfred. You know. Yeah. Thanks for the interruption. Well, it wasn't for you, Bruce. I was worried I might drink all my good scotch. <laughs> for the record, your father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one. It can again, Bruce. Though people like this Catwoman aren't helping. Is she new to town? Maybe. I've seen her before. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. Never seen her before? I'll check the codex. This was our first time meeting Catwoman? Codex. Is this the codex? Oh, we actually have information about the people. Catwoman. Oh, this is Oz, right? Crimes, arms dealing, illegal boxing matches, receiving stolen property. The penguin. Yeah, Oz the penguin. Where's the bull cat woman? Here. New criminal on the scene. I wish I knew more about her. Nice. Not much to find, apparently. Few burglaries, break-ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce or Batman. I'll stay, I stay outside. outside when I need to. Define need to. Uh, whenever Harvey calls, the guy's exhausting. Well, after the press conference tomorrow, I'll mark your calendar as exhausted. Then the media isn't good for anyone's health. I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. We have to be careful. Alfred is you're right, telling you're right. us the truth. Should have cancelled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. It's okay. I, I know you're only looking up. If we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places some <laughs> night. Though I'm not partial to heights. Ah, old men worry. 
that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. Alfred is a good jokester. Park 6 a.m. Oz. In what, 20 years? Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Indeed, you two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stints? That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I... It's not a coincidence. It's only I'll be home. I think it's not a coincidence. Something's you happening. Think you might know something about the break. This cat woman shows up around the same time Oswald comes back to town. Might not be a coincidence. Oswald's crimes, numerous they may be, are on a much smaller scale than robbing City Hall. Well, he was always trouble growing up, but <laughs> it's the fun kind of trouble. You both were. Even though you and Young Master Cobblepot used to be close. I'd advise you to be cautious. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. If the second one is as good as this one, we got an achievement to the one that got away. I, the third one will be great as well. Really good game. Is he really just walking and... Gotham City. Well, we know he's strong and stuff, but still, it's, it's very dangerous to wa walk in Gotham City. Cobblepot Park. Where are you, Oz? Somewhere in there. What's this? Look at ne recent newspaper. The Jorona Gyrus? Okay, let's look. What's, who's this guy? Homeless first. Give change. Let's give this guy a change. Good, thank you, sir. No problem, man. Examine. Look at barrel. Yeah, I forgot it, but it was a Draw graffiti, I think, right? <laughs> you in the box background? What's this? Running late, meet you by the statue. Great. There's the statue, but no Oz. Okay, let's just chill until he comes. Well, it's okay, Darth. I think it wasn't that much of a important thing. Should I talk to this? Why would I talk to this guy? Yeah, I missed the syringe. Oz? Watch wallet cash. This goes through you. Um, you heard it, man. The hell are you waiting? Try and take it. Go ahead. Try and take it. The hell do you say? <laughs> and him. And him? Chill out, man. Gentlemen. Ooh. Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp. You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. And you're holding the moment! Come here! Think that'll do! Damn, did you see Oz? Oh, I actually missed that button. Ooh, Oz, chill. These guys are trash. This used to be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. Ooh, get pranked! Get pranked! Get on! Mine! You hear that? Oh, 
Hey, Bruce. You've got a little, uh... <laughs> yeah. Good as new. Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Besides, someone needed to deal with the rubber situation here. Well, hmm? Thanks for the backup. I oh, ain't too away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. At least I can do is make sure you don't get shaped. Oh, that's very thoughtful of you. Yeah, it's been what? Two decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh, no, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. This park used to mean something. A place that was safe for kids, for families. People came from all over to visit. Oh, Mom and Dad, they put so much work in here. You're right. Well, those were better days. That they were. Yeah. Thought we'd grow up to be kings, I did. Both of us. <sighs> this city chews right through people. <sighs> Mum committed to Arkham. Dad ended it yourself, he did. My family's fortune. There's nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. It's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. Now I lost my parents too. Dark. My parents are gone too, Oz. Oh no, Bruce. I know. I'm sorry for it. But I have my own funerals to attend. Good to know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Balcone at your party last He was uninvited. I didn't invite him. Made himself right at home. Oh. That oily. <sighs> Falcone was an uninvited guest. That's it. Never want to see his face again. On that, we can agree in earnest. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. And are me and him gonna be allies? It'd be a treat to watch him in pavement. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are gonna be on the upswing soon, no? A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. And I'm here to let it in. A revolution? Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. But when my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. I'm not your enemy, you. I guess. We I'm could be friends. Enemy, that remains to be seen, don't it? I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Yeah, I know he's Penguin, but still, maybe we could Good have you, a little Bruce. bit alliance. I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. I guess it's a triple threat. Well, until now, between Bruce. Oz and Falcone. We have a conference. Yeah, we have a three-way. Wow, the Arkham Asylum looks so cool. Well, this is actually better than what they built there. <laughs> Look at our car. Flex. Mr. Wayne, over here, right here. This way. Bruce, Bruce. 
Hello, hello. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. <laughs> oh, we didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. <sighs> now, we're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. You need to talk all for it. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. What's up? <laughs> lacking. And worse still, those who do get out, or God forbid escape, are even more dangerous than before they went in. Call me Asap. is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> but today, with a sizable contribution from this man here, we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility. One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. Now, Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. Bruce? The sick need our help now. My parents will be honored. Crime is rampant. My parents, My parents will be love Gotham. They invested their blood, sweat, and tears in this city. <sighs> You know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice, no matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man <clears throat> who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. Yeah. That's so sad. We need a new face for Gotham. With this facility and our next mayor, we create a new face for Gotham. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. Nice, everything is... But Alf, call Alfred. We gotta... We gotta call Alfred. I'm a... Our homie. I'm sure you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With the opening of this new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? Well, as you can see, there's a new hospital, new building, so we're gonna see till... It Tell her a day has I passed. Think Arkham has only done harm to Gotham. Yeah. It's made criminals more unstable. Put our citizens in jeopardy. We can do better. Hell yeah. All right, who's up next? Uh, you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine. No, I didn't so welcome him. You and Mr. Dent even spoke with him behind closed doors. It's a free country. Falcone is no Falcone is no friend of mine. With Ooh, get on. He was an unwelcome guest. That's all. Next question, please. Please keep your questions on topic, people. We're here about the hospital. Remember? Read text. Come on, it's Alfred. GCPD but Mr. is Wayne, here. This morning, the Globe received evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father. Thomas Wayne. What the what fuck? Exactly are you implying? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Care to comment? How dare you no comment? I doubt your I doubt your evidence. And did anyone else receive this evidence? The Globe, the Gazette, we all did. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Did you Yo, know about this what Bruce? the? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What are you telling us? Your Does source is wrong. Enterprises paychecks? <laughs> I think you should check your source. Sounds to me like an intern is finally putting their creative writing minor to good use. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne, how long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? Did you know about this, Bruce? What are you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. 
I'll be fielding your questions from here on out. Why is the Please, GCPD in our manor? Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. Meet the press. Achievement unlocked. Yeah, in real life they're also annoying. They are a few journalists that are pretty cool, but most hey, of hey, them, careful. ugh. Put it back. Especially okay, game journalists. Says who? This warrant. What? It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. Hey, and you're making a mistake. There's gotta be a mistake. That's what we're here to find out. Maybe we made a mistake. Maybe you did. Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Your holdings are extensive. Who authorized you this? The mayor? Who authorized this? <laughs> I know you and the DA are buddy buddy, but this one came from the top. It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. As long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. Mayor Hill's corrupt. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. Rumors and allegations, Mr. Wayne, that's all. But if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. That'd be a real shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. I've got nothing to hide, man. Good job. Just good job. What did they break? A picture of our mom and dad? Really, police officer? You, you're really gonna break the picture? Yeah, the family picture. Good job. Bruce, stay back! You, you don't have to do this. Oh, damn, that's so sad. Bruce. Bruce. And the soundtrack as well. Bruce? Why is she here? I didn't mean to interrupt, but... Okay, no problem at all. Let's keep it cool. Let's keep it it's cool. It's not a problem, really. Ah, oh, Bruce. First the mayor's office, now Wayne Manor. Hello, the Gotham law... Five zero 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 two five. Really going for the yeah, this account. is my first playthrough. How's it going? Listen, Bruce. I hope you enjoy the stream with us. Surrounding a beloved family like yours captures the public's attention. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Through my connections at the Gazette, I have all kinds of access. I can dig up whatever you need to fight this. But what's your angle? What's your angle? Hmm. Not all reporters just want a headline. Some of us are old fashioned. I still want the truth. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet. And it's all hearsay, flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard proof. Still, allegations like this, they, they don't magically appear. Someone is going after my family. After me. Obviously, the sender didn't identify themselves. We have no idea who it could be. I mean, no one's even done their due diligence on this yet. The press saw the fumble, they grabbed the ball and ran. Hey, I Not think it's media frenzy, away. right? Well, first guess, nosy reporters. The public's fascinated with you, Mr. Wayne. A scandal like this? It's a reporter's dream. Yeah, you can give me hints, but just don't spoil me, okay? Every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my first pass through the rumor mill. I know the damage it can do. Then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need to get out ahead of this. 
Your side is what matters, not wild speculation. Let's give a quote, like... Let's at least defend ourselves, right? I hope she doesn't edit the voice the and do some weird stuff, right? Whenever you're ready. Don't trust Wiki Whale. Just as my family is innocent. The Wing family has always been a cornerstone of Gotham. We have never had and never will. Now that's kind of a spoiler. <laughs> that's exactly what the people of Gotham need to hear. Journalists bad. You're gonna beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Goodbye, Miss Vale. Adios, amigo. Harry really did like Mrs. Whale on the party, huh? To admit it, Trying to flirt with her. Smoke. A fire is heading this way. That man has made plenty of enemies. We've done nothing but support Gotham, even in its darkest days. All this on the anniversary of your parents? It's not a coincidence. Harvey's the district attorney. He should have told me this was coming. Then find out why he didn't. I guess she's gonna edit the voice and do some weird stuff with it. Cafe Triste, 5.23 p.m. Ooh. A warrant? What the hell's going on? Wait, does this have to do with what the reporters were talking about this morning? Someone's after me, yeah, I guess. Someone's coming after me. Let's avoid making another scene, shall we? The press is already up my ass as it is. Mayor Hill authorized this? Yeah, then the cops raid my house, taking everything related to Wayne Enterprises. Computers, hard drives, files... And they even oh, break my You're picture. The DA, Harvey. I didn't know about this, I swear. Hill totally blindsided me on this one. God damn it. He blindsided both of us. He has no us. right to issue search warrants without my okay. <sighs> okay, I, I believe you, Harvey. Mayor Hill's trying to screw us both over with this move. And then he's made two enemies. I just don't get it. Why would Hill stick his neck out over this? Just to tangle you up in some frivolous investigation? That just doesn't make sense. I mean, what could he possibly hope to accomplish other than a few cheap headlines? That is exactly Let's what I intend to Let's not go find. with accusations. Easy we course. have to find it ourselves. Oh, God, what a mess. Bruce, I wish I could just make this go away, but I'm not sure if I can. If I get in the way of this investigation, he would be able to spin it as a conflict of interest. And that wouldn't be good for either of us. It would jeopardize the entire campaign. Okay, I'll do this myself. Then I'll do it alone. Got plenty of resources to fight this. We're in a bind here, Bruce. I'll do whatever I can to help. There you are. Hey, you. Oh my God. No. Oh no, just, my just... God. Oh my God. She figured it out as well. Oh shit. This is Selena. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. Just I'm Bruce Wayne. Nonsense. I'm Bruce Wayne. So you are. Pleasure to meet you, Miss... Kyle. Oh my god, that's so cool. It's a strong grip you've got there. Awkward <laughs> handshake. I'm not gonna fall. Ooh! Oh, right. Sorry. Selena's new to town. I've been showing her around Gotham, introducing her to people. You're an excellent tour guide, Harv. Well, if I lose the election, let's not I guess ask her about drive the, one of those her eye. tour buses around town. I'd take what that brings ride. you to town? So, Miss Kyle, what brings you to Gotham? Business. Well, let's just hope she stays after what happened last night. I was mugged. Ooh. I'm just By who? Batman? Freak, get away with <laughs> all my stuff. I still can't believe I let you walk home alone. I should have called you a car. Mm -hmm. What did you lose? Well, I sure hope whatever he took wasn't too valuable. Actually, it was. God it's damn. probably long gone by now. Whatever that idiot took. I hope not. These were important materials. Ooh. Sensitive? Very. I don't know how I'm gonna explain this to my client. When things like this happen in my line of work, people tend to overreact. 
We should just be thankful you got away with a black eye. Could we'll find worse. another client. Maybe it's time to find a new job. I don't need career advice from you, Mr. Wayne. Oops. Not all of us were born with trust funds and multi-billion dollar corporations. Hey, hey, go easy on Bruce. It's not his fault he was born rich and good looking. Yeah, how are we? Tell her that. I was taking a beating. That press conference? Oof. We've got it under control. Do you? I'll handle it. Someone at my office has to know what's going on. Uh, excuse me a moment. Yeah, oh, this is hey, about to go down. This is about to go down. Okay, listen here, you little shit. Give me back my materials. <laughs> Hello, Selena. What's up? Sorry about the bruise. Nice to meet the real you. Likewise, I guess. Likewise. This explains a lot, actually. How you can afford the fancy armor, the toys. Wouldn't Harvey be surprised? <laughs> Not to mention, everyone in this cafe. Should we say sorry about the eye? Sorry about the black eye. It's not the first time a man's hit me. <laughs> sorry to hear that. Don't worry. I'm not gonna expose you. Yet. Yeah, let's be I'm nice to Catwoman. I do what I do for money, but you're... Bruce Wayne. Bruce Wayne. You already have the money. What's your excuse? I have to. I have a childhood trauma and I'm trying to make the city better. But you... Why take the risk? I have my I think you know enough already. The rest is my secret. Oh, that's 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 was a bad. Was we were starting to get no, sorry, no. Disappointing. The other answers wasn't weren't cool. You have something that belongs to me. I want it back. This is awkward for me. I'm used to robbing. You have something of mine. Back. What? As I recall, you took something from me too. Hope you're getting some use out of that grappling gun. Oh. I'm more interested in how I can use you. Ooh. These people I'm working for, they don't screw around. If I fail to deliver that drive, it's gonna cost a lot more than money. Well, looks like you've made your bed. No, we've made this bed. And I'm not gonna lie in it alone. You owe me. Oh, she's talking about if a they bed. Don't get what they want, there will be consequences. I can help you. I Let's don't help like her. Consequences. All right, you want my help? You got it. What can I do? You can give me back the drive. Oh, that's not gonna cut it. Not possible. <laughs> Listen, I don't have a lot of time. My employer is expecting me to drop it off. Where? Just give it back. The address, now. No, give me the drive. Uh, please, Selena, you need to trust me. Don't piss me off. Let's say the, say the special Selena, word. Please. Give me the address. Oh, he says please when he wants to. Ooh. Okay, Bruce. Seeing as I'm screwed either way. My contact. He'll be expecting a cat. Not a bat. When are you supposed to meet him? Fifteen minutes ago. Oh, shit. Better hurry. Everything okay here? Yeah, it was it's pretty cool. I have my people working on it. We're gonna straighten everything out. I feel better already. So who is Selena to? Sorry, but I've. Harry. So soon? Aren't you gonna stay for a drink? Yeah, Bruce. Stay for a drink? <laughs> I'd love to, but I've got another appointment, and I really don't want to be late for it. Oh, all right then. Don't forget to change into your suit. What are you talking about? I'm already in my suit. Or <laughs> we must be like, what? What? <laughs> Don't screw it up. Batman doesn't screw shit up. Are we gonna fight Help. right now? I'm at the warehouse. No sign of Catwoman's contact. It's quiet. It's quiet. The sound of an ambush. Stay on guard. 
This is gonna be an ambush, right? I hope Selena is not fucking with us. Uh, oh, hell no. This wasn't a handoff. It was a massacre. What the hell happened here? <laughs> no pun intended, right? <laughs> That's what I'm gonna find out. Gordon, Eastside Docks, Warehouse 133. The atmosphere this game has is really cool. Okay, what's this? Scorch marks. The purple Analyzing. gadgets look really cool. It's a volatile chemical. Potential psychoactive nerve agent. Vile stuff. Be very, very careful with that. Who knows what effect it may have. Have the computer catalog the compound for further analysis. As you wish. Could you imagine how cool it would be to have all these gadgets Nothing Batman has? It would make so much stuff easy. Item tags with can be linked to related items to theorize the connection. Can we theorize this? Chemical burns covering the ground. Bloody remnants of an obliterated human body. Whatever exploded did so with enough force to obliterate the person standing next to it. Oh, and we're gonna reconstruct what happened. That's so cool. Not explosive. Well, it appears to have made a pretty big boom. I'll see what I can piece back together. <laughs> Okay, we got this police officer, dead mercenary. Oh, it's a mercenary. I've seen these outfits before. Same mercs that broke into city Yeah, walls. these guys. Yeah, who do they work for? Penguin? We got pallets. Hmm. hmm. Canisters were stored here. Canisters of what? Canisters of what? What's this? Can we open this? Let's open this first, right? Or should I examine it? Wait. The canister exploded, sending shrapnel right through the container door. For once, I'm glad you arrived after the heist. Oh. Your armor wouldn't have protected you against that. Alfred is adorable. He's so cool. Let's mash something, I guess. Oh, you don't need to mash. Oh, what's that? Canister frag. Looks like a bullet stuck at this. A normal bullet couldn't have caused that explosion. Doesn't appear normal. The point of entry is melted. The point of entry is melted? Is it some kind of fire thing? The ammo we got from Clive Barker for the shotgun. The grows thinner every day. Gordon won't be happy about that, I'm sure. Okay, unscorched area. Oh, there's a tire here. Something was here when the explosion occurred. Hmm. This link. What's this? Blast epicenter. Wait, let's. And we investigate everything. White rose. White rose. Isn't this Falcone's uh, mark? Falcone's color. Yeah. He's been busy as of late. Send the drones hunting. I want to know his every move. Let's. Good thinking, sir. Let's beat that guy up. So, uh, what we got here? Don't worry, guys. I'm a really good investigator. I got that. this. Holy shit, is he melted? Face slashed, throat torn open. So, not natural causes then. What could it be? What did this? Do you have anything in your hand? Oh, pocket. Skyline Club. Skyline Club. Hmm. Got something to burnt cop. Burnt. This man's been badly burned. 
The damage seems to originate from inside his skull. Oh, he has a bullet did this. in his skull. I think we can... Ooh. 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 Sensors say it's an incendiary round. Phosphorus residue. This could have superheated the contents of the canister. Causing the aforementioned boom. I guess we can link this blood to the Blood-nets. canister thing we found it's in the human flesh. left side of the area. Bloody hands. Hands uh, soiled with blood and bits of torn flesh. Incendiary bullet. Let's link this to this, right? I think this should do it. I'm a professional investigator. Don't worry about that. Find a connection. The bullet that killed the cop is the yeah, same. Yeah, we did it, I guess. Well, I'm sure they didn't find that at a local gun store. It appears military. Nice. We linked one thing. Continue linking related evidence to reconstruct the crime. Okay. What do we have? We got... Um, okay. Is it... Hansel on bits of torn flesh? Oh, did the police officer do this to this guy? Maybe that could be it. Because bits of torn flesh on his hands. The cop shredded this murk to pieces. Barehanded. What God. the? What would cause someone to do that? The nerve agent could make them psychotic. And I guess the two evidence left is this thing, right? This should work. I believe. Someone drove off after the explosion. Have you put it together? Yes. Valcone leaving his rose here. This is a message. Dead cops, stolen chemicals. He's making a big This move. is so cool. The snipers hit a canister with an incendiary bullet, causing it to superheat and explode. This may have been a distraction or a way of destroying evidence. Cops moved in to stop the theft. Falcone's men got them down. Then things turned grim. Then what happened? Possibly due to the psychoactive nerve agent. A cop ripped up a merc's face with his bare hands. And was put down. Same sniper, same type of bullet. Looks like Falcone's men got what they wanted and escaped. Have you located the shooter? No, but based on two impact trajectories, the canister and the dead cop, the shooter could only have a clear shot from there, there, or there. And would have contaminated himself with the phosphorus residue. Program the skimmers to pick up that signature. Right away, sir. Hmm. I'll locate the sniper nest. Let's try with the left one. And then... Let's move on to the others. Did we actually? Damn, we're good. Phosphor spike. Clear vantage point. We have a winner. Damn. See, professional investigator. So what's this? Cigarette? A cigarette. Killing time. Phosphorus. This is the right spot. So where did he go? 
Oh, well, he escaped, I guess. Trace stops here. Then he should be nearby. Found him. Is he dead? Time to go to work. World's greatest detective achievement unlocked. My turn. Excuse me, but why the fuck was this guy chilling at the crime scene? What the fuck? Don't make me add your corpse to this graveyard. No, Coney, why did he do this? I, I ain't telling you nothing. You, you can't make me talk. Tell me. I ain't telling you, Jack. You trying to scare a confession out of me? I won't break. Your bones will. Ooh. Oh, are we about to do this? True what they said about you. You're a freaking animal. Give me a reason to Give stop. Give me a reason to stop. You know, you can bleed to death without ever spilling a drop. Mm. All on the inside. Tell me the plan, or I start swinging. I ain't scared of you, man. Let's yeah. scare him. Ooh. Tell me. That cat woman was supposed to hand over a drive. Had the container number we needed, but she flaked. So we had to find it ourselves. Uh, container by container. Uh, someone must have heard us. Called the cops. We were told no witnesses. Why risk open war with the GCPD? Some kind of chemicals. How <laughs> Coney wanted them. What are the chemicals for? We were paid to steal them, not ask questions. <laughs> Apply pressure. Oh. I start here and keep breaking until you answer. The chemicals is some kind of explosive, a weapon. I don't know. Falcone said he'd use them. So Used where? That's all I know. I swear. I swear. I told you everything I know. No, let's back out because I don't want to be too violent. He already told us what he knew, I guess. These are cops. Get an ambulance in here. They're gonna need to call the coroner. Talk to Gordon? Let's talk to Gordon. He's our friend, homie. Oh shit! Hey! Freeze! Don't move! Stand down, Montoya. No. Thank God. He was about to kill me. You wanna tell me what the hell this is all about? I told you he was about to kill me. What are you waiting for? Falcone was behind this. Falcone, yeah. I thought he'd been a little quiet lately. Falcone stole a shipment of chemicals. Appears to be a weaponized nerve agent. Causes people to go berserk, turn violent. We need to act before he releases it. I got a task force on it. You already have one. You're taking this too far, Bruce. He's so badass. Are we gonna go after Falcone in the first episode of the game? You assume the persona of a bat, but you're not an animal. You beat that man half to death. Did I though? Your parents didn't raise you this way. And neither did I. He's still alive. He's still alive, isn't he? And in the hospital. <sighs> Next time, it might be the morgue. Especially now, during this preposterous attack on your family. I don't know, that you was kind of weird. World, the true nature of a Wade. Giving everything to the city and then being murdered for it? My thoughts exactly. Every time you leave this cave. Yeah, I understand what he feels. You're he a good man, is good. Just worrying like about him. 
don't lose that. He's like a son to I don't mean to, to be him. a doddering old fool on the subject, but as a friend, the burden of advice falls on me. Sometimes this job requires hard decisions. You're the right man to make them. In fact, I think you're the only one who can. You bury the person, Bruce, but you never bury the memory. That's such a good Sometimes call. Sometimes I wish I could. That night, that alleyway, it made me who I am. I can't get it out of my head. That is your gift and your curse. Being that man can allow you to turn back the tide of treachery that's reached this city's shores or drown you in its sorrow. When you doubt your fate, remember why you started all this. Remember that boy in the alley. Except the I tickets. Won't forget. Neither will I. Why is Alfred such a cool character? We decrypted. Nice. Well, back into the fray again. He is so supportive. He's such a cool guy. Let's use the bat that computer. Looks like that egg. Hacking time, time, guys. And inside, Mayor Hill was hiding more than I could have imagined. This is a complete manifest of Carmine Falcone's criminal organization. What in the world was Hill doing with all this? Illegal arms dealing, drug running, mob hits, money laundering. Falcone's been involved. Maybe some kind of blackmail. See Dad's name on any of these documents. I'll run a search, but so far I don't. Are we working together? I guess so. This is it, Alfred. With this proof, we can finally knock out Falcone's organization. Where would we possibly begin to dismantle it? This is a police matter. There's only one cop we can trust to handle this evidence correctly. Lieutenant Gordon. He could mobilize the entire police force against Falcone. What about that reporter from the Gazette? Vicky. Yes, uh, Miss Vale. She could release this evidence through proper channels. I suppose it comes down to who you want to help most. Or who you think could do the most good. Why the hell would I choose Vicky Vale when I have my homie James Gordon here? I'm, I'm gonna give the data to Gordon. The Vicky, on the front lines of this war. shut up. Gordon needs this more than anyone. A wise decision, sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight. Gordon through the police. We Batman. as Batman. By any means necessary. Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. He's spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. Yeah, we haven't tried yet. Ooh, let's get him. Do we know where he is? This... This is a silver bullet. And it's gonna put Falcone down once and for all. I don't even want to know where you got this. No, you don't. Still, I gotta know one thing. Why give this to me? Don't get me wrong. I appreciate the hell out of this. Because I trust Everyone you. On the force will too. I heard you were the last honest man on the force. No need to blow smoke. I got enough cancer coming my way as it is. But thank you. Honestly. Knowing this evidence can lock up Falcone. <laughs> I'll sleep like a goddamn baby. For once. Damn. You know, as much as I appreciate you calling me here, I gotta make one thing crystal. I can't be bought. So you should know this isn't gonna change a thing about the investigation of your family. That's fair. Well, I'm not asking that. Place. So I'd like to believe there's no cloaks or daggers hidden in your closet. Until we find nothing, though, I gotta play bad cop. 
The investigation isn't the problem. It's the Wayne family name. Help me clear it. If your family's clean, I'll sing it from the roof. <laughs> if they aren't, I'll still sing. You gotta understand, I'm bound to this badge. I understand it, and I respect that, actually. Good job. I gotta go. Came straight from a crime scene. Haven't been home yet. Sometimes I think this whole city's a crime scene. We're just walking through it. What you're holding will make walking it much safer. Thanks, Bruce. Well, Lieutenant? Hey, stick to Jim. If I were Batman, I think I would tell Gordon that I'm Bruce Wayne as well. What would you guys do? It's done. Good. Will so you done. trust Gordon with that Drugs information? Falcone downtown, a place called the Skyline Club. <laughs> Jimmy Neutron? Kind of Hell party. yeah. Well, I can always change in the car. Hey. Oh, my Batmobile? Go get Falcone. Skyline Club. Oh, the club name we found on the dead officer. Oh, we gliding on that ass? Oh, the rain effect is so cool. Hello, droid. Drone. Drones, cameras, and scanning tech are fully functional. All right. Let's find Falcone. Okay, let's do this. Uh, look at balcony. Good point of entry. Okay, we have one point of entry. Nice. Uh, who are these guys? <laughs> Tell me another. What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? Only one of them is organized. Ooh. <laughs> oh, that, that's a, that's a cool one. That's all actually a cool um, joke. Taking drugs, I guess. What's this? Modern art? Nothing here. <laughs> Nothing here. Alright, who's this guy? Hmm. The white rose. Falcone. Yeah, Falcone is the red rose after tonight. Ooh. He's gonna get owned. There's something happening here. I think Falcone must be here, right? That's the most heavily guarded door in the building. Gotta be Falcone's hideout. Well, it won't be as easy as ringing the doorbell. Four armed guards. He can also scan the guns. Stealth, not an option. They have to nerf Batman. Stand by. Well, we already have a uh, mobster. Couple of options for taking this guy down. A large coffee table, large wooden three panel folding. Let's use the large coffee table, right? Can we take him down like this? Oh, that's gonna be sick. Yeah. I'm down with that. I'm down with that. 
How do we take this guy out? Oh, this thing? Oh, hell yeah. Can I just bash him with the lamp? Nice, you'll get out. Yeah, we're gonna go loud and clear. Let's get this guy with what? The staircase? Sure. Let's see how it will look. Ooh. And we got the last guy here, right? We're gonna take this down easy. Easily. Why is this guy tricky? Let's get him from the upper, upper balcony, right? Just jump on him Assassin's Creed style. Remember, no Russian. Nice. Bruce. What? Have you formulated your plan of attack? Yeah. I'm going, I'm going in. in. Let's Very do good, this. Sir. Your turn to crash his party. Yeah, he was so disres disrespectful in my house. I'm gonna be disrespectful now as well. Don't you see me, dude? Damn, he got pranked. X. X again? Ooh, goddamn. Can't shoot me, X again. Nice. Oh, that was so cool. We gotta cut that. Oh, shit. Why can't I aim? I couldn't aim, guys. That was so weird. Are they kind of come get us now? Yeah, Stormtrooper aim. B. X. Y. Pranked. B again. Down. No, bitch. You can't shoot me. Ooh. Got on. And remember, Batman doesn't kill. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, Falcone, you killed your own people. Why don't I? Oh shit! He's gonna. Oh, hell yeah. Get him. Oh, shit. Open the door, Falcone. AK-47. Yeah, break the cameras. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh shit. I didn't see that. Stay down, Falcone. We can end this now. You got a lot to learn, kid. Oh shit. What are we going to use? A and RT? Explosives armed. Fire when ready. Shoot. Haha, <laughs> get pranked, Falcone. Yeah, I kind of say hello to my little friend wives. You want this AK-47? Oh, we could actually aim at his... You've lost. Where are they? I found 
acknowledge your calling card at the docks. The White Rose. You think I wanted to lead you here? Yeah, that's kind of stupid. Maybe now, he's blackmailed. About this old thing, and it is a dead bat. Oh shit! Wiki is here. Play games. We're all being played here, including you. Those chemicals get so riled up about. Never mind. All right. Is that Montoya? But someone. Why did I actually remember that name? Because I did not make that mess at the dock. Then who did? No, with that Gotham's watching now. Go ahead, give him a show. Arrest. Brutalize. Arrest. Why would I brutalize this guy? I'm a good cop, not a bad cop. Spill it, Falcone, while you still can. It's the wings. What the fuck? What do you mean? You wanna save this city? Well, the wings. Are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. <laughs> oh my god, and Alfred is there. Thanks for the assist. Now we only have to take one of you down. Open fire! Montoya, it's me! What the fuck are you doing? I'm gonna tell Gordon about this bitch. Yeah, they can't shoot anyway, true. Fire and smoke could reportedly be seen from street level. Tonight, the Skyline Club, a high-rise mafia hangout in downtown Gotham, was the arena for a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone, who was found dangling over a 50-story drop. Bet Falcone loved that view. Though I'd say the crime boss getting his is well overdue, Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years, but after this dramatic arrest and evidence released by the GCPD's Lieutenant Gordon, Falcone's going away for a long, long time. And speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, this brings me to the story everyone is talking about, the Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. You knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham, that this city for all its faults, was built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here in the company of gangsters, may be just as crooked as his Hey, I didn't hit his shake his hand. What are you talking about? Saying, the Wayne family has always been a cornerstone never had and never will have connections to organized crime in a world where the wings our golden family are corrupt who are we left with who can gothamites look up to yeah they're so making we'll stuff up only time will tell meanwhile we'll keep digging for the truth but the prominent feeling throughout gotham is that the wings time in the sun is ending that's so bad for us Holy shit, what an entrance by Batman. Suit. The car. This entire cave. Master Bruce? Everything I built. I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die. If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, I... What have you been hiding from me? Alfred! Oh shit, that's a cool ending to the episode. I think it's ending, right? It ended, right? Yeah. Achievement unlocked. Family secrets. 
Did you stick up for Harvey in front of Falcone? Yeah, we did. Oh, I love the stats to Telltale Games. Did you provide a quote for Vicky's story? Yeah, and me and a lot of people did it. Nice. Did you break the dock shooter's arm? So that's actually kind of 50 50. Hmm, that's cool. Who did you give the Falcone data to? I don't understand why that 27% gave the record to Vicky. Really weird. How did Batman deal with Falcone at the end? Yeah, most of us uh, handed Falcone over to the police. So nice. Continue to next time on. When your parents died, they left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never betray them. Next time on Batman. Your parents were good people, Bruce. No matter what that thug Falcone told you. And swear to me, there's no truth to it. The evidence you brought me on Falcone held up. Maybe I misjudged you. Now Batman's beating up mobsters too. I wonder who he's after next. Penguin? What is Penguin doing here? Of you. Bruce, the Wayne name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. What's best oh my god, we're teaming up with Selena? Hell yeah. Distance myself. I will find the truth. Along with anyone who stands in my way. Oh shit. Follow Batman's adventures wherever comics or books are sold. This is really cool. Children of Arkham is our next episode. So there are five episodes. Nice. Let's end it here, guys. And we will uh, continue this game when we have more time to. So. This game is so cool. Thanks for joining me, and this was a blast. Well, that cat game, what cat, what was its name again? Etched Memories? Well, that game was uh, kind of meh, but it did what it could. So, um, okay, okay, it was good. It was funny, it was funny, I'll give you that. Uh, the ju the jump scares the game had was pretty cool. The lake monster fishing for us in the sea, in the lake. Pretty good. Yeah, triple A game. Everyone should play that game. Let's, let's do some em emojis, if you will. And uh, thanks for joining us, guys. Next time, we'll be playing Batman, maybe episode 2. Uh, and episode 3. Yeah, Darth, I didn't make it to episodes because I have been streaming since uh, 10 p.m. We played a lot of that cat game. I think you weren't here on that cat game, right? So that game was actually... Actually... Where's the cat game? Etched Memories. Look, store page. Look, look at this. Just look at this. So you go here, right? Mixed reviews. 58%. So uh, we played it for 1.2 hours. Wow, that's, that's cool, I guess. Look. Available meow. <laughs> what? So it has a lot of mixed reviews saying that, well, it runs badly. Let's let's uninstall etched memories. Thank you, thank you. So um, thanks for joining us. Uh, and I will see you guys later.
Good night, guys. Good night. Thank you guys for tuning in. Good.